here Carrie. Hello, hello, hello. I hope you're well. It feels like I haven't seen you in ages. I feel like I say that a lot, but hello. Hope you are well. I'm out. Tom's out working. The boys are with your mum and dad and I am going for a walk. No, I'm not just <laughs> using this child free time to meander through the woods. Uh, I'm actually doing a bit of training for Copperfield for our trek to Amman, which is two weeks away, people. Um, so I'm doing that. Actually, I'll stop while I'm talking because it's a bit rustly and stuff. Um, but yeah, the trek's in two weeks. Greg Rutherford was meant to be coming with me, but unfortunately he's, um, he's had an injury, so he can't come. So my brother is stepping in, so Mario's going to be coming with me to Amman. Um, his team are actually pretty excited. They're obviously gutted that Greg isn't with them, but uh, Mario is such a ball of fun. And he probably, I mean, he's not Olympian competitive, but he is competitive, so sudden rustling of the trees then. I saw an abandoned bike down there, it got me a bit scared. At least I got it on camera if anything happens. Um, yeah, so Mario, uh, he's gonna be a, a bundle of laughs for the team. So our teams will travel separately in the daytime because there's, there's almost 60 of us. So the point is that we'll travel separately so there's only 13 a group, so it's more manageable and we won't be leaving anyone behind. Um, and then at the night time, we'll all come together to camp and there'll be like competitions and challenges I don't know if it's competitions. I guess we just say challenges. There'll be challenges in the evening. Um, and that's where me and Mario will be going up against each other. <laughs> so will our teams. Um, but it's gonna be lots of fun. You can still sponsor me. I will be doing some competitions. Um, I have been doing competitions to get signed books and stuff. Um, I've had, uh, well, I've only got three. Well, I might raise it to four. There are a few um, American editions of my books that I will be signing. You can't get them over here in the UK. So I will be signing them and sending those out to um, the winners. Um, anyone who uh, donates, I get an email to say that you've donated and I literally just scroll through and stop and pick a winner. Um, so anyone that's donated in the past, you're included. Um, and anyone who donates now, um, I've already raised 11,000 pounds, which is unbelievable. Um, but it's that thing, isn't it? I think once you start raising money for a charity, you want to do more. Um, and you guys know how much I love Copperfield. I love Chris. I love everything behind the charity, why it was started. The fact that they do such amazing work to raise awareness for breast cancer and changed, they've really changed the mindset of, um, of young people and how they view their bodies, I think, personally. Um, sorry, I don't know what that sun's doing. So it's something that I feel really passionately about. And you know that, and Carrie, I know you feel passionately about it too. For me, though, it makes no sense having these platforms if we don't use them for good. And, uh, and the work that I do with Copperfield is a massive part of that. The work that I do with Tommy's, and more recently Princess Trust, because me and Tom have become ambassadors for them. Otherwise, it's all self-indulgent nonsense. There's a helicopter. Oh, I carried on walking, but at a slower pace. All right, keep the noise down. Other than that, the podcast is going amazingly. There are only three left in this series. Um, it's, it's been received so well. Every week it goes up to the number one spot on the iTunes podcast chart. Cannot believe it. Um, the messages that I've had are overwhelming. So much love and support. And I love the fact that what we're doing is giving other people um, uh, courage and confidence um, to know that they are doing everything completely right. Whatever you find works for you, works. And do that. Um, anyway, there's two horses, three horses coming. I feel like I should put my camera down. There are the horses. Clop, clop. Um, yeah, so it's lovely getting all the feedback from the podcast. It's, uh, it's doing everything that I hoped it would, um, which is incredible. And I'm already looking at next series and who I want on. I think having that time to sit down and talk about things that are quite personal and having them share, knowing that it's going to be heard by you guys, a massive, um, a massive amount of trust was put into that and, uh, and I've loved every single second and I can't wait to see who's going to be sharing um, next time. Also, some kind of wonderful, uh, my next fiction book that's coming out in hardback, my first fiction book to come out in hardback is being published on the 16th of November. There are now signed uh, copies available and they're also doing a competition in which you can win a trip to Winter Wonderland with me. I am very excited about the Winter Wonderland trip. I'm looking forward to the big sausages and the rides and just general fun that we will be having there. So if you want to be in with a chance to win, please uh, click on the link and follow the instructions. Right, I'm gonna carry on trekking um, because I've got a walk to go on and I'm meant to be getting focused. So Carrie, 
I'll love you a long time. I'll see you when I'm back from Oman, but I'll probably vlog before then. Right, I'll speak to you soon. Bye. We are here on this very earth to love and to be loved.